As the political turmoil in Egypt deepens ahead of the upcoming parliamentary elections, the National Salvation Front decided unanimously to boycott the election scheduled to begin on April 22nd. The Front also decided to boycott the National Dialogue meeting that has been called for by President Morsi. Representatives of 13 political parties as well as public figures attended the meeting. Khaled Daoud, the official spokesperson of the Front, told Press TV that they are skeptical about the fairness and transparency of the upcoming elections. He also added that the movement rejects Morsi's policies because they lead to bloodshed and political conflict. I think that when one political party decides to um, uh, dis decides by its own all the rules of the game, they have to bear the consequences. Of course, from our side, this is not going to be legitimate elections. This is not going to be fair or free elections at all. And I don't think that the Egyptian people uh, will allow a single political party to repeat the same experience of the previous regime we had a revolution against hardly two years ago. Meanwhile, Amr Musa, a leading figure in the National Salvation Front, said that even though the president urged them to participate in the National Dialogue meeting, they decided to boycott it. Musa stressed the unity of the front and that it will continue its struggle with the current regime. We agreed uh, at the end uh, with the majority to uh, boycott the elections. Uh, and not to participate in the meeting of today. Although there were opinions, different opinions, that this should be done. But we uh, uh, all pledged to continue to support and maintain the uh, front, the Salvation Front, and uh, emphasize its unity, its uh, vitality. In his opening statements during the National Dialogue meeting, Egyptian President Mohamed Morsi renewed his call for all parties to join the talks and stressed his commitment to realize the goals of the revolution. While pointing out to the polarized nature of Egyptian politics since Hosni Mubarak was forced out of office two years ago, observers believe the decision by the National Salvation Front to boycott the elections is an attempt to undermine the legitimacy of the vote. Karim Gamaldin, Press TV, Cairo.